Dave Porter taking on one of my most challenging uh, categories that I've ever worked in. On, on behalf of Meet the Wills Town and Vouch Video, we're here with Jason from Barco Thomas Funeral Home. When it comes to these pre-arrangement funerals, there's a lot of benefits. Tell me what those benefits are to the family. The main benefit is emotional and also sensitivity. With the emotional aspect, many times the details, uh, such as vital statistics, funeral merchandise, and services selected are all taken care of ahead of time. So it makes it much less stressful for the family. Another benefit of pre-planning is you can also pay for those services ahead of time uh, by utilizing, uh, I like to suggest the families using a funeral insurance. This way it grows tax-free and it doesn't go back to the recipient who you're making the arrangement for, where if you use this trust at a bank or a trust in general, they would be taxable. This grows tax-free from the date of funding up until the date of passing, and we would also guarantee it for the future, which means we would utilize the interest to offset the increase in our fees or your outside disbursements. Obviously, the loved one or, or the person setting up the pre-arrangement, they could be doing it together as well, really truly understands what the deceased really desires. When a, a person makes a pre-arrangement and it's funded and all the details are taken care of, what happens is uh, we tend to focus more on the passing and the loved one in lieu of what has to be done because those difficult choices or the finances have already been taken care of ahead of time so it's much less stressful and we just focus on the day and times of services. If it's cremation we'll do the identification here prior to the cremation occurring and uh, soon we'll be able to do that on site at our facility as well. Jason, you've been well recognized by the industry in regards to uh, your experience when it comes to all types of funeral processions as well as uh, pre-arrangement services. And tell me about your background and your history. I started in the industry when I was in high school and proceeded and was uh, graduated at 21 where I got my New Jersey license and uh, received also my Pennsylvania and New York State Funeral Directors licenses. From there I received my insurance license which allows me to do the pre-planning aspect. And you must have a funeral director's license as well as an insurance producer license to even write a policy for a family. So that gives me access to not only the trust but knowing how important it is when funding to use the insurance. Okay. What insurance does is it gives people flexibility. If they're younger they could pay over three, four, seven or ten years and unfortunately if they should pass halfway through that policy in one day many times their funeral is paid up where they in essence only paid for half of that funeral. Um, it also gives people when dealing with Medicaid or Medicaid spend down issues you can pay it up front in one single payment policy and that access also gives you the interest from the date of funding to the date of passing. Well Jason it's very clear that you have the facilities here to properly not only plan for a funeral but to actually have a funeral. The location is really a phenomenal location right here in Doylestown. I think at the end of the day, it's really a care and sensitivity that you have for each and every family that comes in here. And when it comes to this category, you want someone with the experience, with the right licensing. And Jason, you have that established track record uh, dating back to how long? Uh, it's been 23 years. <laughs> so long time, long established family track record. And I want to thank you, thank you for having us out and uh, sharing the details in regards to pre-arrangement uh, funeral planning.